What's going on prestige community, it's game time live here. If you enjoyed my video on PMHD, come check me out. My sub link is at the top of the description. And I hope to see you all back in the next video. Bye guys! Yo Prestige fam, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe and turn on notifications. Deuces! Hey everyone, welcome back to this brand new video uploading here on the channel of Game Time Life. So in this video, I'm going to show you the tutorial how to freeze components in GTA 5 Online working after the latest patch. So this has been done using the director motor glitch and basically this is a glitch where you need to have a lot of luck and a lot of patience. So it doesn't work like in 10 times, you cannot so say exactly when um, it works, it just... You know, you have to have a bit of luck, but this is the method how to do it, and I got it fairly quick, so it's different for everyone, so yeah, it is a risk, it might take some time. So, um, I'm going to show you the exact full tutorial on how to do this, so let's get straight into it. So this glitch basically allows you to like freeze um, the Christmas mask for example, so that means you can bring every single outfit online because when you switch every outfit will have the Christmas mask. So it's really really cool. So to start off with the glitch we're going to be starting in a GTA 5 online session and we're just going to make our way over to this week's time trial. Now you have to put on the standard outfit from the clothing store, just, just, just like you see me wearing here in the video. And if you've got that outfit on, you simply want to remove the glasses and then just grab yourself a random street vehicle and make your way over to the time trial. So wearing that outfit with your street vehicle standing inside the time trial, check the following things. Make sure you have your location set over to last location and make sure you have a parachute inside your interaction menu. If you've did all of this, you're ready and you're good to go. All you have to do is drive inside the time trial. So once you're here, you want to press right on the D-pad to start the time trial. Then you just simply want to hold down on the D-pad and using your joystick, switch over to Franklin, Michael or Trevor. Just, just hit X on the alert message and it will automatically go over to story mode. So inside story mode, you want to hold down your touchpad and make your way inside director mode. Accept the autosave alert if you get one and if you load inside director mode, first of all check if your shortlisted actors are empty. If they are not empty, simply hit X and use triangle to delete everything that is in there. So if your shortlisted actors is empty, you now want to make your way over to actors. Go to the online characters and use triangle to shortlist the character where you want your outfits on. So for me, that will be the male character wearing that standard outfit. So as you've shortlisted one of those two characters, go over to the animals and shortlist any bird that you have unlocked. If you do not see a bird in director mode, check the video link in the description to see how to unlock them. So once you got that set, make your way over to the shortlisted actors. It will go over to your online character. Using your joystick, switch over to the bird, then switch over to the online character, just like this. And then you want to hit exit to story mode. So this is preparation. What we're going to be doing right now is we're going to press pause. We're going to online and just making our way over to an invite only session. And now we can start with the glitch. So back inside the GTA 5 online session, again, grab yourself a random street vehicle and make your way over to the time trial. Now before starting it, make sure you apply a parachute. So open up your interaction menu, go to style parachute and just put on the parachute. Now pay attention to the bottom right corner of your screen, it will give you a yellow loading circle. If you see that yellow loading circle, you can now get inside your car. Press right on the D-pad and scroll back over to any story mode character and accept the alert message. So now this is actually a method to bring the outfit online, this is actually part of it, so you must do this time trial part. So back inside story mode, we're going back inside director mode and from this moment on you need to have a rubber band or a elastic. So what you're going to be doing is you're going to grab the rubber band and you're going to put it around your joystick and your controller and then go over to the shortlisted actors and it will go over to your online character. And then using that rubber band it will switch over to the birds and back and forth over to the online character, etc. So, um, if you did it all correctly, you should see that your bird automatically starts duplicating, just like you see here in the gameplay. 
Now, duping the birds can take up to 25 minutes of your time, so from this moment on, you just simply have to wait or do something else in the meantime to um, wait until your character moves over to the hay. Because after those 25 minutes, your character will be replaced for the birds and it will automatically go over on top of the um, bale of hay. So keep that in mind, after 25 minutes, it will automatically move over there. And if you got that, we can then start uh, with the freeze glitch. So after some minutes, you should see that my character moves over to the bill of hay. And if it stands on top there, you have to have to act quickly. So it will be hovering over, it will say your birds. So what you have to do once you're standing on the bird and your character is on top of there, you want to hit triangle to remove the crow out of your shortlisted actors or any bird, doesn't matter which bird you use. Just delete it out of there, only your online character will be standing there. So once you have deleted it, you will see a empty trailer. As soon as you can, back out, go to actors and go to beach bumps. And your online character should move over inside of the trailer looking like this. So if you see the default characters, what you have to do is just shortlist the bird again. Go back to the shortlisted actors and repeat the steps to get it back on top. And then just try it again. So if you see your online character standing here inside of the trailer, you just want to scroll through the breed bump selection to see if it stays inside of the glitch. Now, as you can see in the gameplay right here, it just glitched me out, so it gave me the default characters again. So I'm going to show you um, um, what I just explained it. So I'm just going to be shortlisting my bird again. Then I'm going back over to the shortlisted actors. And I'm just going to get my character back on top of the hay. If you get the same, just follow what I am doing. Just put your character back on top of the bale of hay. And if it's on top of there, just remove the bird again. As soon as you can, go back over to the beach bumps. Just scroll through it and see if it stays inside of the glitch. Now this can take a couple of times, but it is necessary that it stays inside of the glitch because we have to delete our online character after doing this. And if it is deleted and it glitches you out, then that means you have to redupe all the birds again. So make sure that it stays inside the glitch, just keep scrolling for about a minute and then you're sure. So I'm just going to repeat these steps until my character gets stuck inside of the trailer and the default characters do not spawn back. So make sure you do that for yourself too. So as you can see my character is stuck here inside the glitch. Um, I just pressed the square so this outfit came up, but as you can see it do not glitches you out. So now, once you see that your character is just stuck inside, the default characters do not spawn back. You can now hit square to like find an outfit with a Christmas mask or a Krampus mask that you would like to freeze. Now there are a couple of masks that will not work with the freeze glitch. I will leave a link to the video in the description with all the masks that will work for the freeze and the director mode glitch. So make sure you're just only paying attention to the mask and if you want to for example freeze like body armor if you want like pink armor or gray armor you want to uh, shortlist a outfit with the armor that you want but in this video because it is the most asked like question i'm just going to be showing you how to like freeze the christmas mask on your outfit so you can use a krampus mask if you do not have it unlocked inside of your interaction menu so as you can see, I had a Christmas mask there, so this one won't work. I'm just going to be shortlisting it. I have a Krampus mask and I also have a Bad Santa Christmas mask. So these are the ones that will work. So now once you have around three outfits with Christmas masks that you are willing to freeze or armor, whatever, you can now go over to the shortlisted actors and you can hit triangle to remove your online character. So only your three or four outfits with the mask or the armor that you want should be standing inside there. So now this is the method where it comes to freezing. What you want to do is hold up on the D-pad and you want to spam the square button. Just like you see here in the gameplay, it will just scroll over through the outfits. You want to hit square at the same time. Do this for around a couple of seconds. Then you want to back out, go to actors, beach bumps. And just, um, you know, scroll over to anything and hit square to see if anything froze. Now, this process can take a really, really long time. But in the end, you should see something that should freeze over to the outfits. Here, I will show you a couple examples. 
So as you can see in the gameplay right here, you should see that it froze for me the um, like the green armor from that outfit with the Santa mask. This one right here, and as you can see, that armor just sticks on the outfit. So this is an example of the armor that froze over to the outfit. So every outfit has this armor. But I'm looking for a mask, so I'm just going to continue. Here I have another one um, that's a froze over to the outfit. So this is basically also again that armor just freezing on this outfit and then right here i have the gray armor frozen over to the outfits and here in the gameplay as you can see i have those green race boots frozen over to the outfits so these are just a couple of samples that can happen with the freeze glitch i'm just going to keep continuing doing this until i actually have the christmas mask frozen onto my outfits so keep holding up on a d-pad and spamming square until you have frozen what you want to freeze so as you can see in the gameplay right here, I have successfully frozen my Christmas mask together with a green or with a gray body armor on it. It took me like a couple of tries, but in the end I just got it to stick and I was very very happy when I saw that it sticked to my outfits. So what, uh, what you want to do is once you have something that you want to stick, so for me the Christmas mask, you just want to go over to any section where you want to search for your outfits. So from this moment on, you can bring any outfit online because it has the mask frozen to it. But make sure you keep attention over to the blacklisted items because blacklisted items might just, you know, take away things from the outfit and might not bring the outfit online in the end. So keep that in mind. I'm just going over to Meriwether because it gives me the best outfits. I'm just going to search for one to bring it online. So as you can see in the gameplay right here, I have found this super cool outfit with a orange t-shirt, a race belt, some like purple camo joggers and orange and black Tron shoes. I will be saving this outfit, so once you have found any outfit that you want to bring online, you simply want to hit triangle to shortlist it. And if you got it shortlisted back out, go over to the shortlisted actor, scroll over to that shortlisted outfit and hit X to take it inside director mode. Now once you are here in director mode, you want to walk around for at least 15 seconds to give the game some time to see what you are doing. Because if you go really quick on these steps, it might give you a blue screen and then everything was for nothing. So make sure you wait like at least 15 seconds on this part. And after about 15 seconds, just hold down on the d-pad and scroll over to Franklin, Trevor, whatever. You will get an alert message, wait 5 seconds on that alert message, and on the 6th second just simply hit X and it will take you inside story mode wearing that outfit. If you got blue screen it, I know it is really frustrating but I suggest you to just try again and do not give up. This is a feature of the game, there is no fix for it and I know it's really annoying. But if you do spawn in story mode you can now bring it online. So you want to hit pause, go to the online tab, go over to creator, hit X and then X again. So now in the end, you will spawn online wearing that outfit, just like you see here in the gameplay. And you can now make your way over to the nearest closed door to save it up and finish everything all up. So what I suggest you to do is once you've got it saved, just simply hit find new session. And if you spawn in a new session and you still see the outfit in your saved outfits, then you know it sticks. If you have brought white joggers online or everything, just simply change the top, put, it, put a plain t-shirt on it and save it so the joggers won't get removed. It. So this was the full tutorial on how to freeze components on your outfits. This was such a highly requested video. I've been working on this for a couple of times. I'm sorry for the length of the video, but I just wanted to explain this as good as possible. Feel free to leave any questions down below. I will try to answer them all. And yeah, if it worked for you, please leave a like on today's video. And please subscribe for more GTA 5 glitches and turn on post notifications to get informed with the latest videos here on the channel. And I hope to see you back in the next video. Bye everyone! Yo, what's good Prestige community? It's Zav or PMHD here. Don't forget to check out the director featured in today's video if you enjoyed it. Sub link is at the top of the description. Check out our previous videos too. Subscribe, stay tuned, stay prestige. Peace.